Hello and welcome. Today we will learn how to find and remove or fix duplicates in an Excel sheet. We are going to look at two methods. The first method lets us find and highlight duplicates in our data and the second method helps us to remove duplicates without highlighting them and each of these two methods have their limitations and we will see how to get around or augment their limitation so let's jump to method one which is conditional formatting and to use that you select your data click on the home tab come to conditional format and highlight cell rules and then click on duplicate values create the formatting you would like to see for the duplicate values so let's say we come to custom format we pick a pale blue background and then our font should be deep blue okay and that is it notice here that the duplicates are selected based on column so samsung here is marked as a duplicate because there's another samsung here and you find that that's y is being marked as a duplicate because there's another y in the series call but we may find out that the row itself is unique but since the various components that make up the row are not unique is being marked as a duplicate and that is a limitation of using this method to work around this limitation this is what we have to do add an extra column a helper column so we just call it helper column or duplicate let's call it duplicate What we will do in this duplicate column is that we will create an aggregation based on the columns we want to use to select our duplicate. So let's say a phone is considered as a duplicate if it has the same manufacturer, series and phone name. So what we do is we add all these data into one column and this is our data then we select that column and we go back and we make we do our conditional formatting based on this column so when we do our conditional formatting based on this column we can see that our data actually contains only two set of duplicates that is the galaxy m52 and the alcatel 3l so that is it for the first method now let's look at how to remove duplicates using the second method. The first method shows you so that you can decide whether to remove duplicates or not or if it is actually a mistake you fix it. The second method just goes ahead and removes the duplicate. So you don't have an opportunity to look at the duplicates. You may have to know whether indeed they are really duplicates or it's just an error. And that is the limitation of this method but to use this method you select the data click on the data tab come to data tools and click remove duplicates in the dialog box that appears the first row in the data that we selected is detected as the head is if it is not so you can just on ticket and it will go away to consider everything to be data but in this case the first row is indeed our head this will be allowed to be checked and then you select the columns based on which a duplicate should be determined so we want something to be considered a duplicate if it has the same manufacturer and the same series this time we won't add the phone so let's untick the phone and then only these two criteria and then we click on ok and then once we click on OK, it gives us a summary of the data that was removed and what remains. So we have five duplicates removed and 23 unique values remain. So that is it with removing duplicates in Excel. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and please let me hear from you in the comment section. See you next time.